Minister for Food and Agriculture was in Parliament to make a statement and to thank the farmers for their contribution to the nation. The animal sector, which has been badly hit by diseases such as swine flu and highly pathogenic avian influenza, while farmlands were also being destroyed by galamsey activities. Mr. Speaker, we in government recognize that the impressive performance of the agricultural sector is largely due to sacrifices and the tireless efforts of our heroic farmers. Some members of parliament then asked government to provide farmers with the needed resources. The issue is that we have poor yield, and the poor yield is a manifestation of the input that we, 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 we give out. Fertilizer was an issue for us in this, in this farming period. I would urge the ministry to look more serious uh, in, in addressing this challenge of value additions. Mr. Speaker, we cannot talk about farmers without talking about the crop sector and the livestock sector. The speaker, together, those who find themselves in these sectors are doing extremely well to position Ghana at a place that we can boast of. We salute them for their hard work and for their spirit to ensure that regardless of the challenges, every person in our country is fed. And so there is the need for us to provide irrigation to ensure all year-round food production in the country. Honorable Speaker, if we continue in that kind of agriculture, which is so anachronistic and Asian, we will not have the benefit of agriculture. We should move from the kind of agriculture policies and undertakings which are stomach directed. Farmers' Day is celebrated every first Friday of December. This year's celebration.